Hello everybody and welcome back with another video with me, Cookie Swirl C. We've got a Dollar Tree haul today. Look at this, just peek inside. I got so many amazing goodies that we're gonna check out right now, all from the beauty aisle. If you're getting ready for Valentine's Day, it looks like the Dollar Tree is the place to go. But first things first, I wanna check out the nail kits because my nails definitely are starting to chip. So I need a new coat of nail polish on, which is absolutely perfect because I picked up some colors from two of my favorite brands, Pure Ice and Wet n Wild. I picked out four Pure Ice sets in these really beautiful colors. I tried to stick with more Valentine's-y colors, so more pinks and reds and mauves, and I could not resist this set right here that had the black glittery polish in it. So let's check out the red and glitter pack. The red one is called Good Karma, and the glitter is called Galactic Glam. I also picked up this cuticle trimmer too. And that way you can carefully trim right around the nail bed. So I wanna swatch everything, so let me go ahead and take off my nail polish. Gotta give the polishes a good shake. This is almost like a bright cherry red and I'm gonna paint Galactic Glam on top of it. Yes, look at that purple glitter. For Galactic Glam, it does look really watery inside of the polish bottle. Both these colors are gorgeous. Now the second pure ice pack. The solid is all vamped out. Oh, look at that color. It's like a deep, deep, deep burgundy wine color. It looks a little streaky, so it may require a second coat. Ooh, all vamped out, dried very quickly. So now we can go in with this gorgeous like hologram and silver, which is called Dazzle Me. So silver holographic, so pretty. Oh, look at that twinkle. That gives off a lot of glitter. Now for my little pinky nail, I'll open up this one. It comes with one glitter shade and one frost finish matte top coat. It looks like a really dark base with purple and pink and blue glitter called Respect. Oh yeah, it's like a black and I'm really starting to see that pink glitter. These nail polishes are very sheer and they will require multiple coats. So there's just one coat just like that. I'm gonna go back and do a second coat of All Vamped Out just so it doesn't look so streaky. It does look a little streaky. And I want this to be a solid, beautiful color. Yes, just like that. Two coats is all it needed. Now that my nails are completely painted on one hand, I'm gonna seal everything off with the Frost Finish Top Coat and the bottle is really beautiful. It actually looks like a frosted ice cube. Looks like these nails don't really look that frosted. They kind of still look the same with that top coat, but my thumb with the Good Karma color definitely looks mattified. As if I stuck my thumb in the freezer and it frosted just my fingernail just a little bit. All right, I've got one more ice pack before we jump into the Wet n Wild nail polish. So this pack is two solid colors. The peach one is love. Aw, so perfect for Valentine's Day. And the mauve color is absolutely marvelous. <gasps> this is like the perfect peachy color. It's pretty peach and perfect. It's peachy perfect for sure. It's going on a little bit streaky, so I'll probably again have to do a second coat on this one. <gasps> Ooh. Ooh, that color. It is marvelous, isn't it? It looks marvelous. Not as streaky as the pink, but could use a second coat. The love color, still streaky. It would need a third coat. Absolutely marvelous. Looks marvelous with two coats. Those are all the pure ice colors. <gasps> no, I got some of that peach color on my nail. Oops. Now onto the wet and wild. So these are the wet and wild wild shine. Tickled pink. Ooh, actually it looks like it needs to get mixed up a little bit. Some of that color is starting to separate. Ah, now it looks perfectly mixed. Ooh, now this is a softer peach color than the pure ice one. Next one is red red. That's like a true red color. I'm gonna shake it up anyways, even though it looks like there's no separation. Yes, that is a true love red color. That is gonna be perfect for Valentine's Day. I think I'm gonna wear this one. And the last one has such a cute name, Grape Minds Think Alike. Give it a shake. Ooh, that is like a burgundy color. That's very, very, very berry burgundy. I'm just gonna go back in with tickled pink and paint on a second coat. These are looking pretty good. The colors on these Wet n Wild polishes are really beautiful. They're a little bit similar to the Pure Ice. Like here's the reds together. There's kind of those burgundy colors. And then the peaches, oh, but they're both so pretty, like the soft peach and kind of like that darker true peach color. So on my right hand, I'm gonna go in with this clear nail polish that I picked up. 
Now this nail looks really glossy already, but we'll just add that top coat in to help seal in all the color and prevent it from chipping. Ooh, look at those. Those are nice and glossy. That is a really nice top coat. And I really like that frosted top coat too. It actually did kind of tone these down a little bit now that they've actually had a full time to dry. So sorry about that one right there that I accidentally touched it with this nail without even realizing it. But the color underneath does look very, very frosted. So that is really cool. So I was really happy to see Wet n Wild in pure ice at the Dollar Tree. And I think these colors, again, are so perfect for Valentine's Day. I also picked up one of these little nail art pins. What, it's scented? Scented nail designer? Okay, that sounds cool. So you can see on the back how to use it that we've got multiple functions here with these nail art pins. So this is what it looks like. It looks like a lot of fun. The first piece that we have is here at the top. Open it up. Oh, this super tiny, it looks like the smallest pin you've ever seen. And what is that, a little, is that a little bit of ink? It almost looks like a little hair, but I think that's like a little ink strand. There we go. But look at how fine that is. That is tiny. It looks like it would be super duper sharp and pointy, but it's just the little tip of the nail pin and it has to be very tiny and small to get really precise. So how fun is that going to be to like draw like little hearts on your nails for Valentine's Day? So you can use this one tip for precision drawing. Cap that back. I can open up the middle layer and now you can actually use this as like an itty bitty nail polish. So it comes with a polish. Is that raspberry scented? Okay, it just, it just smells like nail polish to me, but that color looks really pretty. So you get a little mini nail polish and then at the base of it right there, how pretty is that? You get a whole bunch of holographic glitter to decorate your nails any way you want. You can use nail glue or you can just put it right there on your wet nail polish. There's a lot that can be done with this and I'm excited. So I'm gonna use the little precision drawing pin tip and you're supposed to draw on like a contrasting color. So just for now, I'm just gonna give it a squeeze and we'll be able to see that ink come out just a little bit. See, it's got like a tiny little ball of ink and now right on my nail, oh, I'm so excited. You should be able to draw <gasps> little tiny designs on it. What do I want to draw? I have to draw a heart for Valentine's Day. <gasps> it's working. Look at that, I actually drew like a little heart. Is this color too similar? This color might be too similar. Let's see, squeeze. Oh, and I can add like little polka dots. <gasps> I love this. I love this. Oh, it's gonna look so good on the pink. Okay, but I am drawing now with my not as strong hand. I am right-handed. So what do I wanna do on this one? Like, I wish I could write out the word love. Oh, that that ink is gonna drop. Okay, I gotta like put it down. What am I, what am I smelling out? I don't even know what I'm smelling out. I put like a T. Is it T for true love? Let's see if I can do another heart, but kind of filled in. And I'm doing it on my wrong hand. Oh, this is gonna be hard. Oh no, the heart, the heart does not look good. Let's try to fix it. It's a little bit of a fail heart. I'll have to get some practice with it. I am so excited. I am so excited so I can draw things on my nail. All right, so let me recap that because I really want to use this hologram glitter on it. So I'm going to remove all of my nail polish and which color do I want to use? Which color do I want to use? Let's go in with the pure ice love color. This one will be perfect. unscrew this and I unscrewed the bottom and now there's glitter that spilt all over. Okay, just ignore this. I'll put it back in here. All right, I got some of it back in here. Let's get back into it. All right, these look pretty cute. So I was trying to do some stripes, but then it kind of got a little crazy here. So I did a, like a mama heart and a baby heart, two little stripes, the word love, a little heart with an arrow through it. This nail's just all red and then some little polka dots on there. Hopefully I'll be able to replicate exactly what I did here on this hand.
That actually turned out better than I thought. I can't believe I actually did that with my left hand. Now I'm gonna take my Wet n Wild Clear Polish and a glass of water, and I'm gonna pick up these teeny tiny little hologram glitters with my toothpick. So I'm gonna paint my nail. Now I'm gonna dip it in the water to wet my toothpick and then place the hologram on my nail. Woo, look at the hologram. This all looks really good. So now once everything dries, I'm just gonna go in with the clear polish and seal everything. I've never spent this much time on my nails and it was really fun to paint them and to kind of put like a little design on them and add some really cool hologram glitter. The clear coat did make the red run just a little bit. You can see that on the word love here. It looks a little pulled down a little bit, a little melty looking. All right, my nails are all dry. It did take a long time for that top coat to dry, but they look so cute. So this little deco pin is really, really fun. All right, what else? Okay, I also picked up some glow in the dark press on nails, glue not included. So I did pick up some glue at the Dollar Tree too. So I'll have to try this later whenever I don't have my nails painted. Oh, there's so much awesome beauty stuff. Okay, literally from head to toe, getting ready for Valentine's Day, they actually have lashes. Okay, those look really pretty. Gorgeous fluttery lashes, just for a dollar. They have the Hello Beautiful Mascara. They have heart little makeup sponges that you can actually keep in the heart shape or you can heart break them apart. You get two red, a white, and a pink. They even had these two little beauty sponges. Now onto lips. They have this really cute lip shape balm, rosy scented, actually shaped like a pair of lips. And when we open it up, there is the red balm on the inside. Oh, it does, it smells like roses. It does actually smell like roses. So these will keep your lips nice and hydrated. They had two lip oils. One is pink clear and one of them was just a regular clear gloss. I don't see, oh, they do have names. The pink one is Pomegranate Passion. Oh, and they're scented too. All right, let's do a little swatch. And the clear one is Midnight Mint, ooh, which is a really sweet, sweet, sweet mint, but it looks like they actually both go on very clear. There's like no color on them. Then I found three lipsticks. These two are Wet n Wild brand. The Baby Dusty Mauve is in the color A Short Affair. Oh, that's like just like a little tiny shimmery hint of color. And the darker pink is Fuchsia with Blue Pearl. Oh, that one's really pretty too. This next one is a matte lipstick by New Color. This one's also gonna be rosy scented. Oh, and look at the tip of the lipstick. It actually is heart shaped. Oh, I love that. That's beautiful. I almost feel like you could stamp this to create like a little stamp of color. Let's see, little stamp. Will that create a heart? Oh no, it's too light. Okay, let's try the color. Oh, it's really soft. Oh, that's a beautiful color. Yep, and it also does have that rose smell too to it. And the last items that I found are the body shimmer. I love body shimmer because you can actually shimmer and shine and sparkle just like a real life fairy. So I really wanna try these ones out. And these are by LA Colors. Oh, these are gonna be so awesome. And these colors actually look so magical. The blue one is called Pixie Dust. So it's got a little paper just kind of holding back the dust so it doesn't just, oh, 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 okay. Or you can open it like that. Wow, look at that color. So you can open it from there or if you put this piece carefully back on, it has a little sheet here. So I'm just gonna use some from here. Gorgeous blue color. Oh, look at that. It just adds like a little twinkle to your skin. The peach one is called Magical Dust. I spilt a little bit of it. No, I don't want to waste any of this. This is beautiful. But look at that color. These are so beautiful. Okay, my arm is really gonna sparkle now. Okay, so here we go. Magical dust. Yes. Carefully put it back on. These lids are not on very secure. All right, we've got the pink body shimmer. This one's in fairy dust. Okay, I'm gonna be really careful opening this one. Maybe I'll just open it from here. Careful, careful, okay, there we go. Really beautiful, kind of a dusty baby pink. So pretty. Let's put it right here. It's a lot lighter than the peach one. Yes, all your fairy dreams can come true. And then we've got the golden one. This is gold dust. Careful. Oh, these are so pretty. I'm so impressed with these. I'm so impressed. Okay, this looks like gold that has been ground up to the finest powder. I've got like, my hands are like super slippery right now. Oh, but look at that color. Look at how beautiful that is. All right, and place it right on here. 
Oh, yes, look at that. So it's just a matter of picking which color do you want to shimmer and shine and sparkle like. Okay, these are messy, but absolutely beautiful. Carefully put that back in. All right, you guys, there you go. This is my Dollar Tree Valentine's Day cosmetic haul. They have so much good stuff. I think this was like the best Valentine's Day haul that I have seen yet from the Dollar Tree. I'm really impressed with everything and I can't wait for it to be February already. I cannot wait. Let me know what was your favorite item from the this haul. Do you have a favorite color of nail polish or body shimmer? Leave your thoughts below. Remember to make up the day any way you want it to be. Just make sure you add in positivity and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!